Okay. Um. So, for this Vita video, or Vita blog, Vita video, whatever it is, um, I'm going to give you guys some tips. All of you incoming freshmen, I'm going to give you guys some tips for your freshman year. Um, not all of them are from me. Some of them I got off of the internet because I didn't think I had enough to hang, so you did add more. Um, yeah. Um, your freshman year is not as scary as you think it's going to be, but it's still always good to have some tips. So, um, first thing, don't look like you're scared. Be as terrified as you want to be on the inside, but don't let it show on your face. Don't look like a deer in the headlights from the moment you get in to the moment you leave. Because every upperclassman will pick up on that and they will just be drawn to you to pick on you. Because it's fun. Um, or at least they are at most schools. Um, I'm sorry about Shaniqua. She decided she wants to come out today. Um, oh god, oh god, don't be a know-it-all. Don't be a know-it-all. Don't, don't be a know-it-all. Nobody likes That is also asking for all of the upperclassmen to pick on you. Um, all of all of that, all of that. Um, it's just not not good, not good at all. Um, if you have a friend that you guys can be sarcastic with each other and talk about, oh my god, that person was so stupid for getting the wrong answer. Secretly, quietly talk to that friend and giggle with them. But you could be wrong, and if you're going to correct somebody in public, only to find out that you were wrong, it's the most embarrassing thing ever. <laughs> um, or oh, gee, that's just that's just a general rule of thumb is you always be friendly. Um, don't get a click, but get a crowd. Um, there's a difference. Clicks are obnoxious, and friends are a good thing. Clicks aren't normally people that are very friendly, but they do have They kind of exclude and do all those nasty things. But make friends with people. Keep your old friends, make new friends, introduce old friends to new friends, get strings of just all around friendship. It works well. Um, if you have any interest, do things. At least try to do things. Um, any clubs, anything like that. Um, it's a better idea than just sitting at home being awkward and never doing anything because if you get out and go and join sports that you like or a club that you're really interested in, you're going to make friendships based off of common interests and that just always helps. Um, that one because I don't know why I have that one. Um <laughs> insults. Never ever ever insult anybody, period. You never know who they're friends with, anything like that. Um and it's not a good idea. Cause you're probably gonna end up getting beaten or sent to the Neither of those being good things. Um, be generous. Run people things, you know, be nice, but don't always be throwing them out like it's Christmas morning. Um, that's what happened. Get used to it. <laughs> There's not a whole lot you can do. Um, don't jump in the middle, try to be Superman and go stop because then they're not gonna stop and it's gonna be like a cartoon where you're gonna have two people fighting around.
there will tend to be a teacher that comes from somewhere. Um, if you're um, a teacher's pet, go get a teacher. Be sneaky though, so nobody thinks you're a narc. Because nobody likes a narc. Um, don't be fake. Don't be fake, but don't be too open. Being fake creates problems when people find out that you're fake, but being too open creates problems when too many people know everything about you and can use that against you. A little bit. Unless you have one very, 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 very best friend, still good. Trust that person. That's. Is it really? No. Sorry, it looks like it's really outside. I can't tell. I'm confused. No, I don't think it is. I think it's wrong. It's dark. Okay. Um. Sometimes you're gonna be somebody's bitch, and you have to deal with that. And hope for the best. There's really no way of getting out of it. <laughs> they will find you. If you try to hide, they'll try to find you. They will find you. Um, <laughs> you're gonna get into a fight. Try to keep it from getting physical. I personally like I'm serious. I'm so, I can't tell if it's reading it up. I'm getting distracted. Um, I don't believe it is, though. So. Um, sarcasm will be your best friend. Don't get overly sarcastic, because nobody likes somebody who's overly sarcastic. Which is one of my problems. I'm extremely sarcastic. But, um, definitely use it. It's a good weapon. Um, and then it makes people look stupid and it makes them feel stupid. Rumors, everybody knows. If you've been through middle school, you already know about rumors. <laughs> they start, they, they can take it for your life. You just don't have to listen. Um, don't be a copy bastard. Don't be. Oh my god, that's one of the worst things you can do is just be cocky. Be confident, not cocky. Don't act like a senior if you're not a senior. You're gonna see the rest of us go around like we're normal underdogs. Seniors are gonna be walking around like they own the place, and that's their right. When the seniors leave, the juniors take over, that's their right. We, as sophomores and juniors and freshmen and all of that, don't get to walk around like we own the place, because we don't. Um, until you're a junior at the end of the year. <laughs> when the seniors are gone, that's when that stuff gets back. Other than that. Um, oh god. Substance searches. Substance searches. Don't drink, don't smoke, don't do drugs. Don't. Do not do it. Do not do it. Avoid people who do do it. And don't think about doing it at school, because you're going to get caught. Substance searches happen, and they find things, and those people get in trouble. Guy, I knew that expelled for smoking on the bus. Keep in mind consequences. Um, just don't do stupid things. Uh, Freshman Friday. It's kind of a mess, but not really. It's, it's, it's our way of intimidating you. Don't get too scared, because it probably won't happen to you, unless you have upperclassmen that know you, and it's fine to play a joke on you. Um, but other than that. And if you're a girl, you're pretty much safe. If you're gonna, you know, um, play up on your assets. That's what you do in high school. If you look older, look older. If you look younger, be innocent. Those are two things you can't really go wrong with. Um, but don't be too innocent to the point where you literally think you're the most innocent being on the planet because then you're. Um, 
it's just be innocent, but when the time comes and you need to not be innocent, don't be innocent. Keep your non-innocence as a secret weapon for only your friends and you. Um, there's a whole list of, of freshman days. I only, I haven't experienced one. Kick a freshman day, trip a freshman day, kiss a freshman day, I've never heard. Um, freshman hazing, prank a freshman and steal from a freshman, never heard. Um, um, most of the things that you see in movies start by something. Um, I think spikes exist, but these out. Spikes exist, bullies exist. Um, just to get stabbed happens. No. Um, and I'm just going to say do your homework because that will end up doing wonders for you. Grades matter. They look at your freshman grades. Freshman isn't, freshman year isn't just one of those years that you can chill. It's as important as every other year that you're going to go through in high school. Everything you do is, is looked at by colleges and how it goes. Um, it's important. D homework, I know, I understand that things happen and homework can become difficult, but I want to say at this point, um, those are the points point, um, when things, I mean, like, nothing's out of the question, but you always bring homework with you. If you have time to do it, keep it, say, in the car where you can run out and go and grab it if you have time, <coughs> or you can do something. Um, and hopefully this helps you. If you have any more questions, I'm here to help. Um, and, um, so I hope you all have a wonderful upcoming year, and, yeah, don't get stabbed or beaten. Avoid too much conflict, and I'm going to go see if it's actually raining. Bye.